What's going on? I haven't done one of these in a long time. Originally I was going to do a weekly update, but I realized that after a while I was just saying the same thing over and over. Sheltered, social distancing, all these words that have become our reality. What, five, six weeks into quarantine? Uh, not much more to say on that end. It's another week in quarantine with this pandemic going on. Another long week of just work. Not that I had so much energy in my past videos, but I realized that I was definitely losing some steam and my energy level was lower even more so. Most of my videos usually have a very soft and monotone voice. Even in my most popular video, one person wrote in the comments, uh, the low key viedo put me to sleep literally. It's okay, I'm not hurt. Actually, I really don't care. I don't really take these videos that seriously. Or should I say, I don't really take myself that seriously in these videos. With that said, I'm going to try to be more upbeat. I'm going to try to speak with more energy. And we'll see how, the, how long that lasts. I'm already tired. With these videos, I'm going to put a little more structure into them. I still want to say a little bit about what's going on in the world, but maybe not in too much detail. Once in a while, I'll do a normal video where I'll just upload or just uh, record my thoughts about something. So here's my new proposed structure. First, I'll talk about the news, both in the world and in my personal life. Then I'll talk about the best voice assistant joke I heard lately. Last, I'll show you my uh, latest Marble Run clip of the week. If you don't know what that is, well, you'll just have to stay tuned. So with that said, roll the intro. What's going on? It's June 1st, 2020, and there's a lot of things going on in the world. Uh, we're still in the middle of this pandemic, but on top of that, we're dealing with a lot of chaos in the world. There's a lot of rioting going on, especially in cities like Philadelphia. Uh, people are angry over the death of George Floyd. Even uh, last night at around 11.20 p.m. or so, we realized we should go upstairs. I'm pretty sure I heard some gunshots. They might have been from the police shooting uh, rubber bullets, but I'm pretty sure they were not fireworks. Um, we're living in an interesting time, and there's just a lot of chaos in the world. There are a lot of people who are in pain and are just confused. We're safe, and I know that uh, we'll get through this period of time. Before that, earlier in the day, Karen dropped off some treats for us um, from our favorite local dessert place, um, Ice Cave. Thanks, Karen. Uh, we were really cherished by that. And then later on that night, I cooked one of my uh, few dishes that I know how to cook, tater tot casserole, skillet edition. Other than that, another week at home and another week working from home. Uh, Bethany only has this week and next week of online classes. And then we're officially on summer break. So now we need to decide what we're going to do in the summer. Honestly, I have no idea. For sure, most of it will be at home, but we'll need to see how we fill up the time. I'll be mostly working still, but this time is the time that we normally go to California. Obviously, we're not going to do that now, so we'll have to see what we do during this summer. Other than that, this past week marked five years working at Penn. It's crazy how fast time passed by. I hope we can get to the point during this period of time where we feel that it's starting to pass by quickly. Now for the voice assistant jokes of the week. This week, these are all jokes from Alexa. What's something you can't smell until it's broken? Wind. What do you call a cow with a twitch? Beef jerky. Why did Mozart rush to the bathroom? To conduct his next movement.
Anyway, thanks for joining me this week. Sorry for the long intro, but I just wanted to explain the new structure of these videos. I hope you are all doing well. Again, stay safe, stay indoors, and stay in touch. See ya.